Hey folks, Craters here. I want to keep this short and sweet, so first off, let me thank you all for the support on this series. I know it may not seem like a lot of views, but to me, this is pretty, pretty wild. Uh, especially in the first 24 hours. I'm actually surprised by the amount of views on this endeavor of this series of Skyrim because, let's face it, Skyrim's been around for a long time. It's a classic for sure, but it's been around for a long time. There's a ton of content already available, especially on YouTube and other platforms. And uh, it goes back a long time as well. So I want to take this opportunity to thank you. Sincerely, thank you. Not only have we gotten some interest in this series, but we've also, there's also been a couple new subscribers since the, the part one has been uploaded. And I want to thank all the subscribers, all the people watching this. Now, after a short recap of part one, let's jump into part two and let's get on with it. Yes, that work. Okay. And basically, oh, it's on the tower stuff, but I'm not looking for stuff. Let's go in the hell in here. Ha! We're gonna burn everybody. One shot, one kill. Wait. What? Wait. Okay, so here we are. Survival adds the need to eat, sleep, and stay warm. It also adds additional challenges, such as no fast travel, reduced carry weight, and leveling up only when you sleep. See the survival mode entry in the help. For more details, we are going to enable us. And we're going to hide because there's a dragon over there. Apparently, he's destroyed Helgen and is moving on. There he goes. Yep. Looks like he's gone for good this time. Okay. No way to know if anyone else made it out alive. But this place is going to be swarming with Imperials soon enough. Alright. We better clear out of here. Uh my sister, Gerder, runs them. Sorry, I know your sister Gerder runs the mill. But I am trying to I don't know if I want the axe. Or the sword. The axe? Well, they both do 9 damage, so I guess it doesn't matter. We'll go with this for the moment. Uh, let's go ahead and mark that as a favorite. Now, if I can remember how to use my favorites, that'd be great. I think it's... Yes, here we go. And then we can set up our toolbars down here, which I'll worry about later. Uh, basically, you got to pick a combination of things and set it to each thing. So when you click the numerical keys above the letter keys, you can select your your groups. Uh, so usually, like, one, two, and three, I will have, like, whatever weapon and flames, whatever weapon and sparks, whatever weapon and healing on each perspective one. Um, like that. Yeah? That made sense. I don't know. Just up the road. All right. I'm sure she'd help you out. Really? It's probably best if we split up. Good luck. I wouldn't have made it without your help. Today. No, you wouldn't have. You would have died... A tragic and totally foreseen death. We are going to split up. We will meet him there because no. you should go to Windhelm and join the fight to free Skyrim. You've seen the true face of the Empire here today. Huh. If anyone will know what the coming of the dragon means, it's over. Really. Okay, and we got a new mission. We'll speak with Ulfric. All right, gather some stuff. We are going to split up right here. He's going to continue on his way. We may catch up with him later. Uh, or I may go into the village with him and then come back this way. That's probably a better idea uh, because there's always a two or three wolves on the way. Oh, oh I'm feeling peckish. Okay. I could use something to eat. We have nothing, so. There's a rabbit. Nope, that's a fox. Come here, fox. That's some food. Sorry, poor fox. All right. 
Oh, no meat. I can't go too far up here. There's some baddies up there. That leads back to Helgen. Did he run off without me? Dang, damn it. I get sidetracked by a fox and he's off. Doesn't even wait. What kind of gentleman is he? Where is he? Maybe we can catch up. Yeah, come back. Yeah, usually he has some commentary around here. That's why I was trying to stick with him, but it eh, didn't happen. Where'd he go? Oh, he just, just completely ran off. All right, these are the guardian stones. Uh, these are three of them. So we got a warrior stone, we got a mage stone, and we got a thief stone. Uh, I think for the moment we're gonna probably go with the mage stone or the warrior stone because this will. Uh, learn our combat skills 20% faster. And the others do similar. Uh, magic skills 20% faster. And stealth skills 20% faster. But I think we're going to go with Warrior here at the very beginning. And look at this. Just look at it. Oh, there's a person down here. Since Rayloff just abandoned us here in the wilderness, we might as well go have a peek at who this lady is. Uh huh? Uh huh? Lion and Boar? Can I steal it? Is she gonna get mad if I steal her book? Oh, hello. Hi. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. Is that right? It's not like my poaching is hurting anyone. No. The Jarl can hardly eat every deer now, can he? Hmm, probably not. There's enough for all of us if you aren't greedy. Is that right? You don't mind if I, um, this is gonna, I am just gonna kind of pick this up. Be careful with that. And I'm gonna walk it over here. Where she can't see me. And I haven't stolen it yet. But I am going to steal it. I just want to do it out of her sight. So now I'm going to drop it on the road here. Now she can't see me. And I lost it. Oh well. Did it like disappear? I just dropped it right here. Oh, well, that was worthless. I was going to eat that fish. Oh. Fatigue. Yes, yes. I, oh, there it is. Okay, got it. It's just blending in. She got any more stuff I can steal? I mean, borrow? I mean, take? I mean, yeah, whatever. You get it. I don't want the book. It's fine. Oh. Fishing spots. Hmm? That's another thing of the anniversary edition. Is fishing. Oh. Is she looking my way? Nope. Oh, that's to use her supplies. We'll leave the chest alone since she's apparently looking that way. It's fine. We're Kind of. Well, she could see me if I tried to steal that stuff. We're not going to be a complete thief all the time, but... Alright, and I'm going to run back up here since Rayloff just abandoned us here in the wilderness. Well, don't wait. Oh, well, I do have a sword. And f fire throwing fingers. What a... Oh, here he is. Oh, no, no, that's Solgar the Wanderer. fellow traveler, one itinerant minstrel and wandering wastrel at your service. Well, I'm not paying for it. Why, to perform for my common man, of course. Why should only the courts and inns of wealthy towns be given the gift of music? <laughs> Until next time. Okay. Somebody help. What? Help. Why does he need help? Ah. Some may find their inspiration tucked away in tomes, or by carousing in the cities, 
But I find it here, in the vast expanses of Skyrim. Good day. Oh, that's not him yelling. Someone do something. Where is this? You won't live to see tomorrow. You can't huh. me. Actually, I do. Here's your girlfriend down. That's it. That's your best. Oh, hide. Ha <laughs> ha. Tell you what, you start running. <laughs> what was that? Something about me starting to run? Mm -hmm. Oh, cooked beef. Bunch of arrows. How many? What are you asking me? Lock? Oh, I didn't want that. It's fine. A treasure map. Okay. I'll have that too. Leave the rest of it. Where's his buddies? Okay. And some of that. I don't want the rest of it. And then the lockpack. All right. Sweet. This is not why I came up here. Was there somebody screaming for help? If I can get up here. Do they have a little camp up here or something? See? Nothing. Alright. But I remember from long, long ago that there is a tragic event that happened right around the corner here. Uh... I thought it was like up here. Yeah, I'm wrong. Huh. Or maybe I took the wrong path. Let's check the map. No, I think I'm in the right spot. I don't want to get carried away. That would be lovely to get that deer, but I'm not going to put Some iron? I think that's iron ore. Oh! Corundum! Oh, that the I'm gonna totally forget that's here. Wow, I thought it was there. I guess I'm wrong. Or I missed it? Back to where these idiots were at. Alright. Is it a different path? It's up this way. No, oh, because we came down this way, right? Crap. I don't even know anymore. Yeah. Yeah, we came out this way. Okay. Oh, it was this path. I, would, I took the wrong path. Right up here. Aha! There we go. So there's some shrine here. Activate the shrine of Talos. We're gonna make use of this gold because we need it more than Talos needs it. Apparently he's not using it. Sorry, mister. Uh, but there's some worshippers here that are apparently dead, as you can see. But they have some stuff that we can make use of. And could just go ahead and activate the shrine of Talos. Hunter, what? This used to be free. <gasps> Did the anniversary edition change this as well? Ugh. I don't have a hundred gold. Well, do I? Actually, I do. 117 gold. But what we came for is this. So he's got... Oh, boy. So we got 150. That's going to put us over. Oh, there's the warmth value. Now you can see the warmth value. So if we head up north into the snowy regions, we want armor that's going to keep us warm. So we're going to grab the Thalmor Orders. Those things. We want that. 
and the robes. So we can handle all of that. And we got four pounds and this weighs 30. So we can't take that. What is he doing with iron armor of minor alteration? We could use that. Oh, don't show me that. Okay. We're out. Maybe we come back uh, as soon as we get rid of some of this stuff. We're not going to continue further down that path because that could lead to our death. Oh, man, is that where the bandits came from? Is this little camp right here? I believe so. Uh, there's a book. Night Falls on Sentinel. Ooh, one-handed. Oh, and we gained our level. We'll go ahead and take that. Even though it's like a pound or something. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Oh, that, uh, okay, I caught that. That was empty. And that's food. Can I? There we go. Search a satchel. Take that, of course. Take that coin. We'll take that seared slaughterfish. Yum. Yum. Okay. Uh, black mage robes. Oh, that's not heavy. And at the worst, we can sell it. We're not going to use a tanning rack. Uh, except for that fox hide. We don't have anything to uh, tan. Okay. All right. Uh, let's go see if we can find what's-his-face. Keep wanting to call him Hadvar, but that's not it. Raylor? Ravor? Ra whatever. <laughs> oh, look at the bunny rabbits. I won't sear them. Uh, is that something I can have? No. Runs off, leaves, leaving us defenseless. And to our own stuff. I don't want to go on that mine yet, but we will soon. We're going to do that early. Grab some more of this stuff. Yeah, right. Craters, why are you gathering all these ingredients? So I can make some potions. Gain some experience. And do some things. Oh, and they did not... I'm spotted. Well, come on, then. Just stand there looking stupid. You're down. Did I get both of them? Oh, that did. Uh, I don't have any... Well, okay. They're going to have to rot. That's fine. We'll come back. We'll take that five gold, though, because I don't have any weight. All right. And we're hurt a little bit. Uh, so let's go to magic and... Let's do healing. Yeah, I know. Magic goes low. Okay. And we're going to go back to flames. Okay, there we go. Oh, butterfly. Oh, that was a lunar. Luna moth. Better yet. I forgot how to make all the potions. Thought I saw something I potentially wanted. Like that. Like that. And if we don't make oh one one little thing over. Uh maybe if we eat something. Uh food. We could drink this. Let's have some bread. That should take care of it, right? Corned beef? Uh here we go. I feel better. And am now satisfied. Lovely. But I'm getting cold. Well, there's a plant we want over there across the river, but we're not jumping in the water because that's going to make us cold. <laughs> Otherwise, I would. Uh, we're not wearing a lot of clothing, armor, stuff, but... And here we are. What did off get off to?
Is that you? No, you're Sven. Feindall thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. She's already mine, I keep telling him. You keep dreaming there, buddy, because she's going to be mine. <laughs> I didn't say that out loud, did I? Can I take these cabbages? Oh, I'm going to carry too much weight again. Is dude working? No. Nope. Crap. All right. Let's drop some of these cabbages again. Son of a gun. Uh, Can I drop? No, I want to drop like, I don't know, three of them? One of them? Two of them? Yes. Right back in the cart. There we go. All right. Cool. Oh, he's in here. Al. You lost? No. Papa says I'm too friendly with strangers. But you seem all right. You don't even know me. Should there be people here? Steal their gold. Oh, I don't think this is the place. I think it's back here. Oh, that's the place. Move it, kid. Aha. There we go. New to Riverwood? Yes. If you're looking for work, go see Hod at the mill. Okay. What can you tell me about it's Riverwood? It's my mill. Oh. Some folks think it's my town, too. Okay. But it ain't. All right. The yard in Whiterun owns the land and the town. Mm -hmm. I just pay the taxes. Okay. Why do you pay taxes if it's his? Never mind. I don't care. Uh. And by supplies, I suppose you mean weapons and armor? Alvor can help you out. He's our blacksmith. Of course. Here's the key to the house. Hmm. Stay as long as you like. <laughs> if there's anything else you need, just let me know. Oh, what's this all about? What are you two doing here? Miner of sure grip. Two-handed attacks do 15% more damage. Ho oh, ho. I'll have that too. I can't take everything. Lockpick, I'll have that. Worry about the rest later. Because I don't have any. Alright. A dragon attacked Helgen and destroyed it. Rayloff and I escaped together. A dragon? In Helgen? It can't be. It is. Although. It would explain what I saw earlier. What you see earlier? Flying down the valley from the south. Yeah. I thought I must have just been seeing things. Nope. It was a dragon. Rayloff will tell you the same thing. I don't know why, but I actually believe you. You've got the look of someone who's just seen a dragon. Things just go from bad to worse. First the war, now dragons. What's this world coming to? Hmm. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Yes, damn it, Lord. is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgruf in Whiterun to send whatever troops he can. Okay. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. Not doing it right now. Can I'm I talk to you? To help any way I can. Um. Eh, can I trade some crap with you? Yes, that's what I want. Top one. Like I said, I'm glad to help in any way I can. Wonderful. Help yourself to whatever you need within reason. Well, I want to give you some stuff, and I can't do that. Okay. I. Oh. <sighs> well, the news you heard about Alfred was true. All right, hold on, hold on. How much overweight I am? One pound. Um. Well, that is stolen. Seared slaughterfish. That doesn't weigh much. Red. Eh, it doesn't weigh that much either. Cooked beef. Um. Oh boy. Oh, those not worth anything. Or do they have any warmth? But I could sell them. Or something. If I use that on the Imperial Sword. Sure. That should do it, right? Oh, shoot. Come on. I'm trying to listen to what the guy has to say. All right, let's drop another cabbage. No, we're going to drop one. Outside dark there we go. Crossing. Like they knew exactly where we'd be. That was uh, two days ago now. We stopped in Helgen this morning, and I thought it was all over. I had us lined up to the headsman's block and ready to start chopping. The cowards. They wouldn't dare give Ulfric a fair trial. 
treason for fighting for your own people. All of Skyrim would have seen the truth then. But then, out of nowhere, a dragon attacked. When your friend told me, I didn't believe it at first either. I can hardly believe it myself. And I was there. As strange as it sounds, we'd be dead if not for that dragon. In the confusion, we managed to slip away. Are we really the first to make it to Riverwood? Nobody else has come up the south road today, as far as I know. Good. Maybe we can lay up for a while. I hate to put your family in danger, Gerda, but... Nonsense. You and your friend are welcome to stay here as long as you need. Let me worry about the Imperials. Any friend of Raylov's is a friend of mine. <laughs> I'm glad to help any way I can. I appreciate that. We can tell him about the Jarl Balgruf? Yeah. I don't mean him. to be disrespectful as he's ruled Whiteron hold well for years. Ooh. But he seems in over his head now. Okay. He's been trying to stay out of the war, but it can't last. He's going to have to pick a side. I'm afraid he's going to make the wrong choice. Uh-oh. I wouldn't say that. But he and Ulfric have been at odds for years, and I'm afraid Balgruf will end up siding with the Empire because of it. But it's hard to believe that even Balgruf would choose Elisif over Ulfric. Hmm. Of course, Ulfric's cause is just. It's time for Skyrim to rid itself of the Empire. The Empire may have been good for Skyrim once upon a time, but those days are long past. Banning the worship of Talos was the last straw. Thalmor everywhere, dragging people off for honoring our own gods. I'm glad Raylof is helping drive them out of here. If I was a bit younger, I might have joined the fight myself. Freedom! Oh, sorry. Wrong. Cross Thing. the river and then head north. You'll see White Run on its hill as you pass the falls. Okay. Got it. Who is Elisif? I suppose she's Jarl Elisif now. She married High King Turig just before Ulfric killed him. Oh. The Empire supports her claim to be High Queen. Okay. I don't really have anything against her. Not her fault that her husband Turig was bought and paid for by the Empire. But she's nothing but a puppet for the Empire now, with her husband Turig dead. Ulfric will make sure she never takes the throne as High Queen. Wow. Okay. Um... Well, we know Ulfric killed the High King. So. No, not until the Moot meets to choose another. And it won't meet until one side or the other wins the war. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, though. Ulfric is our rightful High King. He'll drive out the Empire, and Skyrim will have peace at last. Okay. I think that's all we can learn for now. Right, Thanks, then. sister. Oh, I knew we could count on you. Yes. I ought to get back to work before I missed, but did anyone else escape? Did Ulfric... Don't know. Don't I'm sure he made it out. It'll take more than a dragon to stop Ulfric Stormcloak. I'll let them into the house and, you know, show them where everything is. Hmm. Sweet. Help them drink up our mead, you mean? Yes. Good luck, brother. I'll see you later. Don't worry about me. I know how to lay low. <laughs>